Hi, I'm Dr. Raj Shaw of Math Plus Academy, and I'm back with another math treat. This one is called Chess Queens, and our objective today is going to be to put as many queens on this 8x8 chessboard as we can, such that no queen attacks another queen. So let me show you what I mean. Uh, a queen in chess, in case you're not aware, is allowed to be on any square and then can move up and down as far as possible, left and right as far as possible, and on both diagonals as far as possible. So as, for example, if I were to place a queen right here, that queen um, could attack all the squares in the same row, in the same column, on this diagonal, and on that diagonal. So let me go ahead and mark those positions. So you can see that a queen has the ability to attack a huge number of squares from any position sort of near the center of the board. Now, the challenge is going to be to start placing more and more queens on this board so they don't attack each other. So now that I've marked off all the places that this queen can see or can attack, I can try and place another queen. Maybe I'll put my second queen right here. And then I'll mark off all the squares that aren't marked off already that this queen can attack. So everything in this column, and the row, and the diagonal, like that. Okay, and we just keep placing queens. Now, the challenge is, can you place eight queens on this chessboard so that no queen attacks any other queen? That's the challenge. The good news is this is easy to play with. Get some graph paper or something, or if you have a chessboard, you can start putting pieces down. They can all be queens, and then you can check to see that no queen attacks another. So some ways to just physically play with this. Or like I said, get some graph paper and try it that way. But see if you can get eight queens onto this chessboard. If you find one way, then try and find other ways, other solutions to this problem. So this is a fun little challenge with the chessboard. You can also extend this to think about, well, what if I have rooks? Rooks can go up and down, left and right, but not diagonal. How many of those could you put on a chessboard so they don't attack each other? What about bishops? Bishops only go diagonal. They don't go up and down or left and right. So you can try this with the other pieces as well. The knight, which has the sort of funny way to move. How many knights can you put on a board? So try this. It's a lot of fun to play with these different chess positions. But your challenge for today is, how can you find a way to place eight queens on this chessboard? And as always, when you think about these problem solving things, you might want to try a smaller chessboard first. What about a two by two chessboard? How many queens can you put on there? What about a three by three? And as you do that, you might discover some ideas, some patterns, some techniques for placing them in ways where they don't attack each other as easily. So as always, try this, give it your best shot, and remember, always have fun just playing with them.